Hey guys, what is up? Julius here. And today I have a bit of a different video for you, which you might have noticed. I decided to create a free preset pack from Premiere Pro 2022 with the transitions that you saw in the intro. The preset pack specifically contains five color glitch effects and or transitions, meaning they can be used for both. They are incredibly easy to use. You just apply them to an adjustment layer with the amount of frames mentioned in the title of the preset. There is a download link in the description and it is completely free as previously mentioned. So yeah, go ahead and download them if you want to. And if not, don't. For the people unfamiliar with how presets work, let me give you a short introduction to how you can import and use them. First, you should navigate to the download link in the description so you should arrive at this Google Drive here. Where you will see this file called Julius Sorensen Color Glitches version 1 2022.prfpset. And in here you want to click on this one, right click and download. Like so. And this file you just want to save somewhere where you remember where it's located. I'm going to save it in my project folder. So it is here right now as you can see right here. Now we're inside Premiere. And what you want to do is go over here to effects and presets, right click, import presets and navigate to the folder where you saved it to. And just double click it. And now you have the presets imported right here, all five of them. And these titles of the presets basically just mean what they do. So this is a digital glitch into invert glitch, which has a length of 30, 30 frames. And all of these you use by applying them to adjustment layers equal to the amount of frames that it says. So for example, this first one, if you want to use this, I am going to apply an adjustment layer like so. And I'm going to make sure that it's 30 clips long just by holding down shift and pressing my right arrow six times. One, two, three, four, five, six. Like so. And what I'm going to do now is just apply this to the adjustment layer and you will get all these imported. And take a look. Easy like that. And these can both be used. It's like a transition between clips if you want to. So let's try another one, shall we? So this next one that I want to show, which one should we try? I'm gonna drag this on top and go 10 frames to the left. And 10 frames to the right, so it's 20 frames in total. Like so. And I think what could look nice here would maybe be the digital glitch chromatic aberrations. Let's see how that looks. Yeah. Take a look, guys. Easy as that. So that is basically how you apply the glitches. And for example, this one. They do not have to be applied, it's a transition. If I wanted to, I could also, if I wanted a glitch like mid this clip, I could also just apply that, right? So let's say I want maybe invert chromatic aberrations. Let's see how that looks to make it really glitchy. So as you can see, easy as that. PCS then so go ahead have fun with them but anyways thank you so much for watching guys i hope you enjoyed it and learned something new and can use these presets for something make sure to like comment and subscribe but anyways see you tomorrow guys